Hey you guys, what's up? So we just finished off another building in the Viking Village and it is beast mode. Me and Huckstore are going to join up in a second. He's just over there now. He's actually recording a secondary intro that he's going to use for his video. Ho ho, behind the scenes. So anyways, this is the building that we started working on earlier today. I never want to break another rock for as long as I live. However, this is the building. It's completely done and this is where our forge is going to be. We're going to we're going to show you guys the inside of this now during the video and we're gonna go ahead and make a forge for our Viking village which is coming along quite nicely we've been doing a lot of work on this lately a lot of mining a lot of metal stuff a lot of stuff that's boring and you don't want to watch or see and well yeah let's uh, let's go ahead we'll meet up with Huxor now and we will begin our tour of the new building all right so I think we're just about ready to take the mammoths here and go and gather up the last little bit of metal we're gonna need for this thing what are you thinking man I got a little bit of a problem I'm stuck in King Chomper <laughs> Oh you no, wanna... King Chopper, what are you doing? Oh, there we go, I'm free. All right, I broke free. War Machine, there you go, buddy. All right, I'm just going to jump on Beast of Burden over here, and we are going to do this. Oh, man. I got like, to gotta find a way around this stuff, man. King Chopper's tail is too big. I can't get by. I need your help. Let's see. Oh, no, are you still stuck? Really? Yeah, I am barred in. He, he will not let me out. That is funny. I was over <laughs> here looking, and I noticed there's a ool node right next to our base, man. Like, I have mined that sucker so many times, but it just keeps coming back i'm okay with that man don't don't complain about it be happy that, right? that stuff keeps on coming back right there's i think there's even a little metal node that keeps spawning back here which is pretty cool i'm not gonna bitch about it well they respawn everywhere man like there's one up right there there's one like yeah. over there somewhere like it's great to get metal around here too oh i need a pickaxe i just re i just realized let me just see yeah, if this I, guy has i one. just repaired up all my stuff making sure we're good to go here i have all my stuff put inside the chest up there sure hang on let me just go grab it real quick <laughs> uh yep that's me always prepared Let's see, did we do anything different in here? I don't even know. Did I show this off to... Just kind of looking around here. Uh, yeah, if you guys haven't seen it, this is the inside of the Great Hall now. This is what it looks like. Nice, right? Cool. I don't Let's know do what this. I did with my stuff. <laughs> um, oh, no, man. Is, is there is there? Oh, wait, I think I found it. Okay, I found it. There, right. I mean, there's like some primitive pick, picks and axes and stuff like that on the mammoths, but they're kind I, of like... I just got happy. it, man. I just got it all now. All right, we're good. We are finally good. Okay, we're gonna act like that didn't happen. Okay, so hello everyone. We are going to go and do this. <laughs> right, yeah, all right. We're good to go. Anthomia has his tools, guys. We're <laughs> off. We're off on the mammoths. Oh, I man. love these big beastly creatures. They're so beautiful. They have like coffee it. holders too. Look at the top of their head, man. It's flat. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. That makes the perfect coffee table or coffee, oh, hell yeah. coffee table. <laughs> coffee. You said coffee table the first time. Why'd you repeat it? I don't know. I love saying that word. Right now, I'm, I'm staring at my mammoth's big, luscious, furry booty, and that sucker is just, like, so beautiful, man. Yeah, my guy's trunk's right up in that right now. Yeah, he's definitely getting a whiff of uh, Beast of Burden here, which <laughs> is a female. You know, the name really doesn't suit her, but he's a Beast of Burden guy. She can carry well over a 1,000 pounds. She's, let's see, I just want to look. I'm very curious. 1156 pounds this girl can carry come on carry mine could carry 812 not as much but you know what mine's still better anyways because it's completely blacked out oh yeah yeah that definitely makes it superior mine's matte superior. black <laughs> i love your whole reasoning there you're like oh because it's black <laughs> it's better hell yeah that's that's it that's how the sleepless <laughs> gamers do it man all right so i'm just trying to remember where ah, come on okay you know what <laughs> i'm just gonna go ahead and knock these trees down I'm just yeah, let's just go ahead down. and bulldoze them bulldoze through that yeah there we go <laughs> yeah i know we have close to 2,000 metal ingots part so i mean we don't really need but maybe what um oh God. i think it's like 2800 i'm pretty sure it's 2800 this oh, is sweet. what we're looking for buddy look at all this metal look all at the door delicious. up there a door yeah there's a uh, door there oh there is somebody i guess built a base up here well yeah, i hope they don't mind we're taking their metal yeah well you know what what they don't see they don't know so what they don't see, they don't know. That is true. Yeah. That is a very true statement. <laughs> what they see don't hurt them, I think, would be a better one. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, if they do um, see, we're going to have to hurt them. I, right, I'm just going to call this a five-finger right. discount, man. Oh, man. Okay, so what are, we, what are we needing here? I know we got around 2,000 metal ingots back at the base. I'm guesstimating here. That's a rough guesstimate. Now, <laughs> guesstimating? Much, I'm guesstimating, you know, a whole guess <laughs> estimation thing. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to use this sometime. Word. It's my, it's my word. Now, is it trademark? It is trademark. You can't use that. <laughs> yeah, you can't use that. Now, what is it in total that we're going to need here as far as metal? Because I'm pretty sure we got everything else cut covered. I think we're going to... 
I think we're gonna need like 1600 metal man because you get two metal you get uh, one metal bar per two metal that you mine out of a rock and we need like 800 more okay all right well I guess we got a lot of work to do then we're just gonna yeah. farm the hell out of some more metal we it's hell not yeah. like we haven't been doing this for days you know yeah, what I mean? well, like days and days and days like right oh, man. oh dude I didn't bring any food with me I just now noticed oh I I've got some jerky on me don't worry about it do you? Okay, all right, cool. I mean, if we have to, we could probably kill some. I do have some berries here on Beast of Burden, so if worst case scenario is, I'll just eat some berries and poop a lot. Yeah, pretty much. That's not bad, though, because you get water back from it, too. Oh, yeah, that's true, you do. Yeah, cool. Nice, all right. All right, guys, so we're back. We've went ahead and made a few trips with the mammoths, gathering up metal, and me and Thomia noticed something here. Um, we don't have a loading bay for our workshop and it does make it rather difficult trying to unload the metal as you can imagine you know carrying it down this long hallway here now while the metal is melting up in the forges i think uh, me and thami is going to work on maybe making a loading bay what do you think Hell buddy? Yeah. Uh, loading bay would uh help out a ton like i was just thinking over right here we have a little room that we like we didn't know what to do with it so just come over come over here this this right here like we could make two little ramps on the edge of this knock out those walls and then we could like easily bring the mammoths over and like jump down and like grab the stuff and then run back up that and then jump off the uh off the side of the forges or i mean that's a good idea but i was also thinking like we could just take the walls and the roof off and just kind of have it where we pull up beside it with the mammoth so we don't have to jump down we can just access the mammoth while we're up there yeah yeah that's that's what i mean with the uh with the ramp type of thing like uh, uh, we'd have hmm, how do i how do i explain it uh do i have no i don't you know what we'll uh we'll just knock out those walls and then i'll show you what i mean with the ramps all right man cool let's go ahead and get this metal in the forges here so it can be uh doing its thing god it wastes so much uh we have so much metal going right now. Holy crap. Are you going to let me out? <laughs> Freaking beast of burden was got a block at the door there. So much metal. I got to like run outside to my mammoth and you're just like creaking in the doorway. Just, hey, how you doing? Give me some more metal. And it just throws it down with its trunk. <laughs> just hand it through the window, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? You've got the smart mammoth. Oh man, man this, this forge is, is almost full. Yeah, like oh, we've got so much freaking metal. This is crazy. All right, there we go, guys. We have three forges working around the clock now. While they're doing their thing, let's go ahead and work on the loading bay. So, what are we thinking, man? Like, we're just gonna go ahead and just knock the walls off. Start with that. Yeah, I think we'll we'll go ahead and do that. Is it the slope wooden roof? I think it is. So I'm just gonna make two of those. Hopefully, I'm not being stupid with this i think i might have it maybe uh hey. we're gonna find out in a second it'll be fine we've got a crap ton of like thatch fiber and wood so i mean if nothing else man we can just experiment until the cows go home yeah all right let's all right, uh, so get up here this is pretty nice i'm just gonna go ahead and pull up one of the mammoths right beside it just to kind of see how this works just to kind of check this out oh man actually let's take just kind of check this out here you know that's not bad that's not bad right there maybe if see, we i was blitz, gonna I'm, I'm trying to figure out how we could make this better. Like, go ahead and show me your idea. I want to see. Oh uh, no, it's not working with the roofs. I actually have to make the slope thingies. Ah. Uh, oh really? Right. Like the little yep. sloped walls? Ye no, not the uh, not the sloped walls. I have to make like the actual uh, slope that comes in an arc. If I can find it, do I even have that learned? I don't think I have that learned. Oh man! Wow. <sighs> you know what? Just give me a second. I'm gonna find this now. Like literally, I have to get one of those before this is all over with. Right, I th we're gonna have to like gate this area off, but the idea I had come on come on work work with me Please work with me. Is this do I have the right ramp selected? Slope wooden roof nine Are these the ramps or the, the slope roofs? These are these are the ramps there we go okay. We're gonna have to like make okay. a door or something But I mean like we could easily you know use that or maybe can I like bring this guy right up there? Oh look at that There we oh, go wow. loading bay <laughs> He's just doing a cat stand I guess we could extend it out and make like more of a platform with ramps so that way you oh, can yeah. get the whole animal up there, you know, like the whole mammoth. That would yeah, that that'd be nice. Work. That'd be a lot better. We could just like, yeah, we could extend it out, put the couple, uh, put a couple pillars like out this way a bit. Yeah, we could make that work totally. I'm just going to put these here and call it good, man. I'm just going to call it good. That's fine right there. <laughs> Maybe we could turn this into like a dino pan if it doesn't work out as a loading bay. I mean, regardless, yeah, I guess we'll do that. You know, regardless, we can still just kind of pull up right beside it if we need to. Just kind of like so, you know, just like, oh, there we go. Right here beside it. Oh, yeah, I can access this inventory. That's yeah. good. All right. That I mean, works. Yeah, know, that might work. There's lots of room. 
But, um, you know, if any of the subscribers, the viewers out there, hey, if you got any ideas, let us know down in the comments because uh, we're kind of stumped on that one. We kind of spent probably 30 to 40 minutes working on that, and I don't think we got anywhere. Hey, why is this Forge out? Uh, did it run out of spark powder? It did. Okay, let me go ahead and throw some more spark powder in here. I know we've got some. I crafted up some earlier. Here we go. Yeah, here we, here we go. We got plenty. Great. I landed on your head. Wow. Did you really? Yeah, so where are we going to put this giant forge? Like, yeah. are we going to put this just, like, right against this wall? Yeah, man. I mean, that's the reason I moved all the forges, and, you know, when we extended the roof, that was the idea that I had in mind, like, right there. I think that's all the right. perfect place. It'll, it'll be the fit. centerpiece. If it'll fit. I don't even know if this thing is going to fit. Oh, man, if it doesn't fit and we have to raise the roof, oh, no, it's going to be a bad day. Well, I mean, that'll be the second time we've had to raise the roof, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, literally, that, you know, we originally the roof was only um up pretty much to the top of the door right there on the balcony so yeah. i mean that was where the original roof was if that gives you guys any kind of an idea how much you know work we had to do just to make room for this damn thing just too much mining just too much stone and too much uh i will say this the good thing about the snow biome is metal and oil and crystal and rock is everywhere you can't spit without spitting on one of those resources so i mean i will say that about the snow biome it yeah if we were in a different biome i think it might have been a little bit tougher man to tell you the truth yeah i wouldn't have uh i wouldn't have had as much fun i mean like at least everything is close knit here so like there's a metal node right there just as i come right? out and then to the left of me that oil node keeps on respawning yeah. so i mean it's all convenient it's win-win it really is like anytime we normally need metal all we gotta do is run outside because they just keep respawning all over the place it's a it's a good thing but at the same time it, it can be a little frustrating because you're like what the hell why the hell is this here i just broke this Oh, just so you guys know, these fires actually do damage to you now. Yeah, that's weird. So we're back, and we finally have everything needed to craft up this beastly industrial forge. Are you ready to do this, man? Oh, man, I don't know. I'm having second guesses on this because it's costing so much metal. Right? It's costing us our oh, ice box. It's costing us our uh, industrial grill. I mean, we're losing out on so many things, but we're going to be able to <sighs> smelt metal like a freaking champ, man. Yeah, no more. We'll destroy these forges. Yeah, you know yeah. what? We'll I'm going to get rid of these now. Oh, I can't destroy them. Only you can destroy them. Okay. okay yeah, <laughs> we'll, we'll get them out of the way here in a little bit. Um, But, I mean, if you're ready to do this, man, are you ready? No backing out. Yeah, I'm all, right. I'm all ready, I all guess. Right. All right, let, let me turn this bad it. boy on, and let's do it. Now, as you guys can see, we have all of this resources just crammed in this bad boy, and let's do it. Let's just do it. I'm not even going to look. I'm just going to push let's it. Just do it. Craft, do it. Craft item. There it goes. Oh god, everything disappeared. No, oh no turning back. No <laughs> turning back. Oh my goodness. There it is. Oh, that was so expensive. Ooh. Oh god. Oh man, refining forge. Look at that. That is just a beautiful <sighs> thing. I, I haven't looked at this personally yet. I, I know you haven't, Thomny. I know you've made a video on this already, but I'm just like, I'm just. Ooh. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. It Let's do massive. it. Ooh. Hey, it will fit. Will it? Yeah, it's gonna fit perfectly. Nice. Oh, man. Sweet. There it is. Whoa, there we there go. Is. Look at that. Look at this monster. Holy freaking crap, dude. I feel like I'm yeah, standing know, in a right? room with like a nuclear freaking bomb or something. It looks like a nuclear reactor. Look at the size of this thing. 27,000 health. I didn't even realize that. Are you Holy kidding me? Crap. We need some gas, man. Let's turn off the fabricator. God, it hurts to look at how much that thing costs. Oh, oh wow. Okay, all right. Let's put some gas in this thing, and uh, let's go ahead and gather up. I'm just going to go run outside real quick and gather up some metal out of one of these that respawned. And oh, God, it's like a shrine. Let's start bowing and praying. Right? We <laughs> need to build, like, a little statue to monument this occasion. <laughs> The yeah, day I know, right? we spent all of our resources on a forge. <laughs> Dude, I'm pretty sure this thing is like the most expensive thing in the game right now, metal-wise. What about the, like, rocket turrets? We're gonna, I mean, we were planning on building the rocket turret, or at least the minigun turret, too. And we kind of used those resources on this as well. Yeah, we got, um, a, we got a lot of grinding ahead of us, man. But at right. least we can smelt the metal really fast. I've got 33 pieces of metal here that I just picked up from the little mining outside. And let's see how fast it forges. We're watching. This is amazing. We're waiting. This, this is, is so cool. This better be worth the money. The suspense is killing me. Oh god, here it comes. It still hasn't forged. What the frick? I thought this thing was supposed <laughs> to be fast. Did we just it forges get, a lot fast. Did we just get ripped off? 
Wait for it. It's going to happen, man. There we oh, go. 15. 15 at a time. Okay. So yeah. that's not bad. That did 30 raw pieces of metal and broke it into 15 metal ingots. That is pretty nice. I like that. That, that is, is pretty not sweet. bad at all. Okay. And it looks good there, man. Like, it's the perfect centerpiece. Yeah, I like that a lot. I think it complements like the room. Matter of fact, I'm just going to climb up here. I'm just going to look at it from up it here. It looks so badass just walking in here and you got this giant forge. Just like It looks like a nuclear reactor, man. Like, this man. thing looks crazy. Wow, that thing is just... <laughs> I am, oh, you know, I'm really glad that we did manage to get the roof built up high enough. I was really worried about that. We just barely made it too, man, like at the skin of our teeth. Like, yeah, I mean, originally we thought about stopping right here where the railings are for the viewers out there. And I'm glad we didn't because we wouldn't have been tall enough if we had to stop right there where the railings are. Like right below yep. the railings. We wasn't going to have that extra wall there. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's a good thing we put a couple extra hours of work into that. That's, oh. And we still got some room on the side here, so we could probably put some more of the storage boxes back that we had over here originally. We can just kind of set them off to the side. Oh, yeah. We could definitely do that. All right, guys. If you enjoyed the video, smash that like button and subscribe today to feed that late night video addiction.